Hi, today I'm sharing another variation of the chocolate cherry smoothie with different ingredients. So today I have the pure black cherry juice that's organic from Lakewood. It's 100% pure juice. And I also have the Four Sigmatic plant-based protein that has um, mushrooms inside. And I also have a smaller size of um, walnuts and cacao beans. Um, this is going to be just more for one person. So I'll show you how I do it. Again, you just want to add a tiny amount of water to make the nut milk because if you add too much, it won't turn into a creamy consistency. So I just added the uh, walnuts and the other ingredients with a little bit of milk. And in some ways, this is actually too much water, but I'm also going to be adding the protein powder and um, other supplements. So that's why I, I dipped use a little bit more water to this and I'm going to blend now. So I just finished blending everything. Now that's the nut milk and now I'm going to add the rose petals. Before I blend the rose petals, I just want to point out the right time to pick the roses. So basically when the roses are about to shed the petals is the perfect time to pick them. Um, that's when they're the sweetest. If you pick them when they're just a bud, they're going to be uh, too astringent. But at this point, right when they're about to fall, the, um, the tips um, at the base, they turn sweet. Um, the red ones are a little bit more astringent. Um, they're still excellent. Um, different colors tend to be sweeter, like the oranges, I think, tend to be sweeter than the reds. The reds are a little more astringent, but they're all delicious. And again, when they're about to fall is really when they're, quote unquote, the ripest. Okay, now I'm going to blend. Forgot to say that um, at this point when you're ready to blend the roses or if you were going to make a green smoothie before you add the greens, that's when you can actually add some more juice, um, whatever kind of juice you're going to use, but you can add a cup or however much you need um, to the blend. Again, the, the less you use, the creamier it will be, So, but you don't want to blend too long either. Okay, okay so I finished blending the roses and now I'm going to add my supplements the protein powder and after that then I'm going to put the cherries in to make sure the powder doesn't fly everywhere and then I'm going to blend for measurements I'm using about a pint of the frozen pitted cherries it's not quite a pound but it but it's a pint